Welcome. This training video covers how to edit measurements. There are multiple reasons why you may want to edit measurements. We will cover two scenarios in this video. First, we will discuss how to edit while taking a measurement. And second, we will discuss how to edit a measurement after it has been taken. Start a measurement by clicking in the ribbon bar or double clicking in the trace list. While you are taking a measurement, you can undo the last change made to the measurement by clicking the Undo button in the ribbon, or by pushing the Backspace key on the keyboard, or by pushing Control plus Z on the keyboard. Undoing the last change made includes each point as well as other functions performed while measuring like creating an arc. After undoing a change, you can then continue your measurement by clicking each measurement point. You can cancel the measurement by clicking the Cancel button in the ribbon bar or by pushing the Escape key on your keyboard. If you need to edit a measurement after it has been taken, first select the measurement, then to delete a measurement point, right-click on the point and select Delete Point. To edit measurement points, click the Edit Points button or push the E key on the keyboard. You can now click down on any point and move it, or you can click between any two points to insert a point. To add a point to the end of the measurement, you would use the Add Points button or the A key. This will add a new point at to the end of the measurement like this. You can also move or copy a measurement. Make sure that measurement is selected and then click the Move slash Copy button. This will put you in Move mode you can click down and drag the measurement to a new location. To copy the measurement, hold down the control key while you click down and drag with the mouse. You can do this as many times as you'd like to copy the selected measurement. Thank you. This is the end of this training video.